So I'm sure a lot of you guys have those reverse chokes in your plays where you're just playing through the map, you miss in the middle of it, you FC literally everything else, but these plays of yours only get rewarded like 60% of the overall value, and you're probably feeling pissed. Like, you literally hit the whole ass map except this one slider that you fucked up, and you're probably like real pissed about that. You have some of those in your top plays, and you were wishing it got buffed. Well, I have some great news for you. So this combo scaling removal thing in Osu game, you know, Everyone is out here getting free PP from this. Like, who doesn't like free PP? Everyone's pretty much getting buffed. And this was essentially fix some combo scaling issues where those maps where you literally hit everything else, but you miss in the middle, these maps would usually get very nerfed in the current state. But this combo scaling removal would essentially buff them a lot more. So perhaps you would only get like 60 to 80% of the overall PP if you fucked up right now. But those same plays are going to get buffed to like 90 to 95% if this combo scaling removal were to be implemented. So it is an if. I don't know if it's actually going to get implemented. But if it does, that would be pretty cool. And this would essentially buff pretty much everyone and their mom out here. And this combo scaling removal did come out like a week ago. And you guys are probably thinking, okay, Kapnori, I know you were out here being very fast, making the videos as soon as they came out with the PP reworks. You were out here pumping them out literally an hour after the release. What happened if this one? Well, I just want to say that I have been busy with some IRL things lately, not really playing much of video games or OSU, not really caught, catching up to the OSU news. So I just finally had the time to make some videos right now, which is why I'm making these videos right now. And that is why I'm talking about it. So the combo scale removal, I think in general, it is a very good thing. But one of the things that I do not like about the combo scaling removal, so for example, maps where you fuck up at the end, right? You only miss at the end. You hit literally everything else. Maybe you got really nervous. These maps get a lot more nerfed. So for example, one of my plays on this affection map, right? It would usually be 450, but it gets nerfed to like 430 or something because I miss like literally at the end. There was this one jump at the end that I fucked up and this map gets a lot more nerfed. I feel like they shouldn't be as nerfed that hard because you still hit like a lot of the map, but you only miss at the end, but you get nerfed like so much PP. And I just feel like that aspect right there is a bit unfair. I'm sure if you guys also look at your top plays, I'm going to link it below the calculator where you can look up your own profile. But you would also find some of these plays where perhaps you got really nervous at the end and you fucked up. And these plays get nerfed as well. And you guys are probably thinking, okay, that sucks ass. And I also agree with that. And also, I feel like some of the maps where you fuck up the whole ass part in the middle, but you hit everything else. These plays get buffed a lot. Like, I feel like they should get buffed. It's a good thing. But I feel like they're getting over buffed. So, for example, one of the maps in my top play is called Arcadia. It's a five minute stream map. I have a 400 on it and it would choke for 500. But I missed in like the middle of the map. I literally hit everything else. So, 80% of the total PP value is pretty fair, I feel like. But more of a buff would be nice, right? And this map would get buffed to 480 out of like the 500 that it should have gave, which is a lot more. And I feel like this is a bit of an over buff because. I missed on some random ass part in the middle of the map. I literally hit everything else, but I feel like this buff is extremely unwarranted. I feel like it's extremely high compared to the maps where I just fucked up in the end because plus 80 PP just for me to hit like everything else, but in the middle, it just doesn't feel right for me. Like I can't really put an actual logical indicator for that. I just feel like a 95% overall reward for your fuck up on that map where you only miss in the middle is a bit excessive. And that's kind of my thoughts on that one map in particular. There's also some other maps in mental plays where it's also getting that treatment. And perhaps that map does deserve that much PP. I don't really know. I feel like it doesn't. I feel like maybe it should get but maybe buffed to like 430, 450, not exactly 480. So I'm sure a lot of you guys also have these type of plays where you miss in the middle, but you FC literally everything else and you probably see like a huge PP increase on those maps. And you guys are probably real happy about that. I mean, who would not be happy about getting free PP? I feel like some of these maps getting buffed too much. Maybe I'm just used to the current system right now where you would get punished very heavily if you fucked up in the middle. And I feel like that huge increase in PP and reward, I'm just not used to it. I feel like that's something that I'm just not used to. That's why I have this negative feeling towards it. But I feel like it's a bit overbuffed in the maps where you choke at the end and you miss. It's a bit over nerfed. And that's kind of all I want to say in this video about the combo scale and removal. And there's also some top players opinions about this, like FG Sky. So he basically said, I'm a fan of combo scale and removal because I'm so fucking bored of this. You only get rewarded if you get high combo metal. That's been going on for a century at this point. So essentially maps with high combos, length bonus, these maps get buffed a lot. Like if you're playing Save Me, for example, the whole map is pretty much piss low. And then there's like one hard part at the ending. And then you just get a huge combo and you get a lot of PP just for comboing like piss low parts. 
and that meta right there is kind of boring right and it doesn't exactly reward maps that are extremely difficult but you fuck up in like in the middle but you hit everything else but these type of plays would not get rewarded as much as if you were playing save me so i do agree with what fg sky is saying right here where the current pp meta is kind of boring where you just get rewarded for high combos but these maps were like perhaps there's lesser combos but like you miss in the middle of it and you hit literally everything else these maps getting buffed is overall a very exciting thing to see and i really like that as well i think in general the combo scale and removal is a good thing for the oc Uber. but i also think that some things are getting over buffed some things are getting over nerfed and this overall update to it six days ago is also a good thing because you should get rewarded for doing more challenging things and succeeding in them and if you fuck up on some easy part you should get punished less but that's pretty much all i want to say in this video about this combo scale and removal and i'll see y'all all right but this is just a random yap at this end of this video just a bonus footage but the other day I almost died and I was basically walking through the pedestrian street trying to cross the street and I was not looking in both ways. I was kind of just looking at my phone and this truck was crossing to take his right to go to the church that was right next to me and it almost hit me. I almost died. My body acted before my mind and I backstepped so fast like I was playing Elden Ring and you could backstep and I backstepped so fast from that truck. And I was one foot away from meeting God in the heavens above. But I just wanted to give that story right there. It was a bit traumatizing. And the next time, I'll always be looking both ways when I'm crossing the street. So that's also a lesson for you guys. Do not be like me. and Just look at your phone while you're crossing the street. Or else you could be out here looking like ground meat. But yeah, I'll see y'all.